Bobby people, I'm back with another video and today I got some new gel polishes in from Nail Reserve. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and get these swatched out for you, show you the new colors that I've gotten in. So let's take a look-see here. I love when they send me over some gel polishes because they always send me over so many cool colors. So I'm going to take these all out and we'll get to swatching. These are all the colors that they sent over, so let's take a closer look. First color here is Goddess. Ooh, and this is a really pretty red. Oh goodness. Look how nice and pretty this is. It's just ever so slightly deeper than a candy red. Kind of reminds me of kind of like a scarlet red. Really pretty. Tempo. Ooh, this is a really beautiful black with a lot of fine hollow glitters in it. How nice is that? Very, very pretty. Look at that. Kind of reminds me of like the galaxy or something, really pretty. Find Me, which is a very light lilac purple, very pretty. Sun is Back, nice, which is a nice rich gold color, very, very pretty. City of Love, I thought this color was really pretty too. So it is a red with some really beautiful fine hollow glitters in it. Kind of looks similar to that tempo color, but just with a red kind of pinky base. Next we have Bronze Me Baby. I love that name, so cute. How oh, nice, this is a really nice kind of, it's a light yellow, leans a little bit pastel. Very nice. Loving this formula, by the way, of Nail Reserve. Really nice and creamy. Perfection, ooh, really beautiful nude, love that. Kind of like a nice brown nude color. And then we have Mind Doodles. That's also another fun name. Ooh, really nice bold blue color. Really pretty, I like that a lot. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and get these colors swatched out. Goddess, ooh, nice. Loving this red so much. Um, and I love, I feel like Nail Reserve changed their formula when they went from Nail Addict to Nail Reserve, I feel like it's a lot um, smoother to work with. Um, the consistency is really nice. It's, it's creamier, it's not as thick um, and slightly goopy like it used to be. So I'm really loving this new formula Nail Reserve has. So that is Goddess Tempo. Oh, that's fun. Yeah. So this black isn't as deep as I was expecting it to be on the first swatch. So you'll definitely want to go in with two coats of coverage of this. Find me. Very beautiful, soft purple. Beautiful coverage, self levels nicely. Sun is back. Ooh, that's a nice gold. I like that. Very pretty. The glitters are here. The glitters in here are packed very nicely, I must say. Button here, City of Love. That's a nice. This color is also a little bit jelly too, kind of like that tempo color. Um, so you'll definitely want to go in with two coats of that. You see how you can still kind of see through it. So you want to go in with two coats of this. Bronze Me Baby, really beautiful, light yellow. Kind of reminds me of like a lemon yellow, you know. Perfection. Go ahead and cure. Mind Doodles. Now this color here is a little bit thicker. So this kind of reminds me of that original Nail Addict formula, the original Nail Reserve formula where it's a little bit thicker, but it still applies very nicely. And it has a really beautiful smell to it. Very sweet. It's a pretty blue. So this is what all the colors are looking like swashed out and with two coats of gel polish. So really quick, I'm gonna go through and show you all what they look like up close. Goddess, which is a really beautiful like scarlet red color. Tempo, which is a really beautiful um, black with hollow, really, really fine hollow glitters. Really gives me galaxy vibes. Find Me, which is this really beautiful light purple, soft purple color. Sun is Back, which is this really beautiful golden color. It's really gorgeous. I actually 
quite mesmerized by this uh, gold. It was really nice as I was applying it. I like that it kind of has those slight silver specks in it as well, silver uh, fine glitters. I'm a big fan of this gold, really pretty. Love of City, which is a really cute, kind of red, pinkish um, glitter color. Bronze Me Baby, which I absolutely love the name. It's a really beautiful soft yellow. Um, almost pastel, but not quite. Maybe giving kind of lemon vibes. Perfection, this is a really beautiful, nice um, brown nude. Mind Doodles, which is a really beautiful blue. This here is all the new colors that I just got in. Um, I am in the mood to do some sweater nails, so I'm gonna show you guys a really quick way to do some sweater nails. I'm gonna try it on a couple of the different colors here. So you guys can see, you don't have to just try it on like basic Christmas colors, you can try it really on any color. I have my um, nail tips here. I wanna do the sweater nails on red, as well as on this nude color and also on this beautiful lavender color called Find Me. So I'll be using Goddess, Perfection, and Find Me to do some sweater nails. So let's hop into it. I'm gonna go in with two coats of all the polishes on all the nails, and then I'm gonna cure in between each layer. I'm going to cure. This is what two coats of polish looks like. I'm going to go in with um, a layer of my Nail Reserve Matte Top Coat and apply that to all the nails. Just going to do one thin layer. Okay, so in order to do sweater nails, you'll have to go in with the color that you actually used on the nail and paint the design that way. So I'm gonna go ahead and put just a little bit, just one dot of each of those colors onto my nail palette here. Alrighty, so now that all the nails have been cured and that they're matte, I'm gonna show you all how to do the design. So I'm going with this liner brush as well as this liner brush, okay? So I'm gonna start with my red nail, okay? I'm gonna start by making lines going down the nail like so. So I'll do one line here, 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 and then one line here. Okay, and then from there I'll go ahead and connect the lines and that's going to give you that sweater look. Do that again. Okay, I'm gonna try that again. I'm gonna make my lines a little bit shorter. So I'm gonna go a line here and a line here, a line here and a line here, 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 and here. And then you'll just want to connect the two lines. So like so. at the bottom, okay. What the, okay. Okay, we're gonna try that one more time. I don't know why I'm having such a hard time with the sweater nails this time around, but all right, let's do it again. I promise I've done it before. All right, so this time I'm gonna just go ahead and draw the whole line as one, that way I don't get confused about where they need to connect that. So I'll do a line like this. Okay, a line like this, and a line like this. And I'll just do kind of one more right here. Okay. All right, that's what I got. <laughs> I'm just giving the lines a little bit of thickness because um, I am gonna be pouring clear acrylic powder over it, and I want it to have something to kind of soak into. Okay, so that's that part of it. And then you'll want to take a straight line straight up and down the side of the nail like so. Okay. And I'll do that on the other side of the nail like so. My lines might be a little too thick, but we'll fix it on the next nail here. 
then from there you'll just do little ticks on the side like so and then do the same thing on the other side like so okay so this is the sweater now now the key is to not cure it you want to keep the gel polish wet you go in with clear acrylic I'm going in with my young nail speed clear okay and you'll want to just pour the product on top and make sure that it soaks into that wet gel polish there and then when it's done you'll tap it off like so and after you tap it off you'll go ahead and cure okay so now we're going to repeat that process on the next nail and again um, see if I can perfect this little the middle part of this <laughs> Um, so again, you'll want to go in with that same color you used and just kind of create that sweater design like so. I'm finding that it's easier to just kind of do it all on one with one line instead of like drawing separate lines and connecting them. Like so, that looks good. So instead of going in with this brush, I'm going to go in with my long striper brush. I'm going in with my long striper brush and get the lines on the side for this particular design. Like so. Same thing on the other side. I like my design is a little off center, but that's all right. We're gonna go with it. And then we'll do little tick marks on the side. And then again, once you have that done. Take my little cupcake liner to catch my, my extra powder, and you just pour it on top of the wet gel polish. I want to make sure it gets every part of it. Tap, tap, tap. And then you go ahead and cure. So in the past, I've also done like sweater snowflake nails, so I'll show you guys how to do that. With the sweater snowflakes nails, you'll want to do a line dots up and down so I'm gonna start in the middle here and just draw dots going up and then dots going down and then dots off to the side off to the side and then some diagonal dots Okay, so from here, I'll be honest, I actually just like how that looks as it is. Typically what you'll do is you'll go through and connect the dots, but I actually just like how the how it looks raised. So I'm just going to cure like this. It's pretty. Yeah, I like that. I'm going to cure. So really quick, I like using the cupcake liner when I do this design so I can just pour my powder right back into my cup. And then there's no spillage or waste of product here. So I'm going to close this back up. This is how the nude nail is looking. The last thing you want to do is just brush off the excess powder. And you have your sweater nail used, guys. Look at that. How lovely. That turned out great. You all see the design there? Really beautiful. I love it. This here is the red nail. You'll do the same thing. You just want to dust off that excess powder. And you have that raised design, that sweater. And then last but not least is this beautiful lavender purple color. Look at how cool that is. It turned out really cool. I like the snowflake that's just like a dot. You see, that's really cool. 
I like how that turned out. Okay. This is how all three nails turned out. I am loving how my little sweater designs came out. I do want to play around with sweater nails even more, like just, just trying more um, different designs with that kind of sweater look. I just think it looks really cool and really different. So yeah, I just wanted to bring you all some more nail art for this holiday season in case you guys were wanting some ideas of some different nail designs to do. I want to give another big shout out to Nail Reserve for sending these products over for, for review. I had a great time working with them. Um, I do love their formula a lot and y'all see this awesome design I was able to get with these products. And so yeah, I do have a discount code with Nail Reserve. I will leave it here on the screen as well as in the description box below in case you guys are interested and want to get your hands on some of the products um, I do think they still have a 60% off sale going on um, but I will leave my uh, discount code the links um, for all the products I use down in the description box below in case you guys want to get your hands on it I do upload every Tuesday Thursday and Saturday if you all like what you saw here definitely stick around join the happy family I'd love to have you and as always you guys leave some love in the comments down below and I'll see you in my next video I hope you all have a wonderful awesome spectacular day bye